So now we have Polak just and Marek. To number three, winner in blue for Hungary, Kovacs Kitty. It's time to welcome man three in the first round for women under 52 kilo. In white for Turkey, Bushra Akio. And in blue for Romania, Roxana Yovanza. Patrick here looking the more dominant here, desperately out to win this match. Chido been awarded to the Slovakian. Oh, goodness me. And what a turnaround there. Just needed that wheel wrap on the knuckles to say get started and a Wazari given to Pulak. Who puts him in a great position now with three minutes to go. Uh, looking into the knee was and all he needs to do is control the upper part of the body and get that leg out a little bit quick on the the mate i would have thought that um, the referee would have let that go a little little bit more considering how tidy it looked down there in niwaza On mat two, winner in white for Germany, Ines Weishmi. So one minute, 42 seconds, and the Slovakian is really is leading here quite comfortably with the Wazari on the board. Looking more and more confident as the minutes go by. Alexa now picking up a Shido. One minute and ten seconds left in this match. Oh, lovely Kosoto there, just stumbling his opponent down into the Niwaza. As he looks there for the Niwaza, but again, really no 
major openings there for him to react off of. Again, a lovely drop seeing Aggie there from the Slovakian. Keeping it very tight indeed as he goes down into the Niwaza, making sure he leaves him, doesn't leave himself open. So we're just under half a minute left. Polak of Slovakia is looking in a very comfortable position right now, but I've spoke too soon too many times already and it's only the first part of the morning. And it could go all horribly wrong as the Ukraine scene in the earlier match. So the change of pace now, very aggressive approach to this match. Maxa really trying, oh goodness me, and is it, also <laughs> as I said, it could have horribly all gone wrong there for just five seconds to go. Patrick almost had that Niwaza there, the Osakomi was almost on. Was that his final chance of getting through to the next round? Well, I think so. So one second to go, and I think I can comfortably say now that Polak of Slovakia will go through to the next round. But a great match between these two gentlemen.